Hey everybody, hope everyone is doing okay. The something I missed in the previous video was that the bank that is Buxby doesn't need to make a profit because it is created by the people. So it's not an entity that that has to capitalize on itself, which is a stupid mechanism to think about given that it's what people do that gives money value, not the other way around. Anyway, just I don't like doing little bits, but I thought that was critical because I missed that. Okay, this video is about education in the Bucks Fee community. One of the things that's fundamental, I think, for people's empowerment is access to education. So, in the Buxby community, there would be the, the, the bank would pay for people to be educated. It pays teachers and students the same amount uh, based on whatever they decide is appropriate. That's because a lot of the issues, I think, the issues that we have is people don't have access to education or that you have systems that want you to pay for it even though it may be useless. And so it has no meaning. When education is based on peer-to-peer -peer agreement, then it's up to the teacher educator to present what they want to offer for the benefit of who they're teaching not because of some curriculum that's meaningless it's applicable and the one thing that Bucks B can afford is that people can teach about how to create sustainably where in the money world our user recurrency world there is it's a nice token thing but you actually can't apply it in the economic model because there's no money in being sustainable. So that's that's a really critical part about Buxby. It's not that education is free, it's your pay to be educated. That gives you a foundation to use Buxby for purchases in the future. And if people aren't or don't have skills that uh, are useful, they can be educated in it and be paid to do it. It's it's out of respect of the people who were not able to do the things that they wanted or just um, or never got the chance to be educated in the first place. Okay, short, sweet. I uh, hope that's useful. Um, we'll get into some bigger parameters in the upcoming videos, which is ultimately how it affects economics, politics, and social structures. Take care.